reacts at times a little slow. But it's okay, it's like life, man. You come back and deal with it, and you get better. Hi, I'm Dan Matthews from the Daily Mail. I, ju I just wondered what you saw in the performance tonight that gives you confidence that in a rematch at one hundred and fifty-four pounds that the result would be any different. Who are you talking to? Eric. Very Just wondered what aspects of the performance tonight give you confidence that you could change the result even at one hundred and fifty-four. Um, because <coughs> I know I'm a lot better than uh, what I showed tonight, and um, I know that a lot of things was out for me, and uh, even though it was Terrence Crawford did we supposed to show off and move on point, we made sure that we got to some regular in fight. And you show me and skin and hand skin. But first of all, Errol, I want to ask you, what did Derek Jerry say to you in terms of supporting you after the fight and how long it has been to you? And is this officially your last fight at 147 in your mind? Uh, <laughs> yeah, in my mind, it's not that I'm paying 147 pounds, so you know, hopefully the next one being 154, but um, Derek, you know, just sent to so many that, you know, keep my head up, you know, I was off and, uh, you know, trying to come to console me like he's supposed to. And Devin, just in terms of you consoling him and how you feel about this, what's been the plan to be your process over the next few days to be able to move on and then just go back to the drawing board on Well, you know, I knew that the boxing, I had time to uh, understand what was going on. From the first, second round, I kind of saw what was happening and kind of like, Understand, okay, maybe eventually we can get a good shot, maybe we can um, recover. But it didn't work that way, and it's okay. I think it's like, unfortunate. This is just what happened in big time boxing. Somebody got to be in this situation, unfortunately, with us. And we uh, got to move on. And we're not to, I'm to fly to London tomorrow, so, you know, I think I'm going to hold on this for a long time. May not have to get over it until I can be revenge it. But it's just what it is. And, you know, it's life. You just got to keep it moving. You got to deal with it, embrace it, and move on. Yeah, two more.